example, this is someone who's had a concussion, and when the brain wiggles, there's actually tearing and stretching of these white matter tracts. So the brain has the consistency roughly of jello. It's surrounded by water, and then it lives in a hard skull. The brain actually jiggles. I had a patient, it was a cold, you know, rainy day, and the ball was thrown very hard, and she headed it, and that heavy, wet, cold soccer ball hit her skull, and forces are transmitted to the brain, and the brain actually jiggles. And that girl, when she drove home from soccer practice, got nauseous, threw up as soon as she got out of the car, and that led to a concussion. So I've seen that firsthand as a clinician. I'm all for sports, and soccer is a terrific sport. We're getting some idea that a soccer ball repeatedly struck in the head or someone jumping proactively to head the ball may be doing some damage that won't be known for decades.